What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Daisy and it is the morning for me and I've been seeing lots and lots of comments of you guys asking me what I eat and what I eat on like certain days of certain muscle groups that I work out. Like today I'm going to do abs, cardio, and arms. I've been incorporating cardio into my workouts just a little bit more. I'm trying to do them on the days that I do my arm days. Um, that way on booty days I can like solely focus on weightlifting and building my booty. Um, that is also another question actually that you guys had. Um, do I lift weights? Yes, I definitely lift heavy weights for sure. Um, so yeah. But what I eat today is just what works for me. Every single body is different, so what works for me might not work for you. But this is kind of just like a routine that I found, and I'm gonna kind of give you like the little guide to like what I do. Um, I usually intuitive eat, so I don't have like a strict, su well, mm, I, I don't know, let's see. I kind of like intuitive eat mixed with counting macros. So like I listen to my body and what I feel like it needs, but I also try to stay within like a certain guideline of macros. Um, so right now I'm trying to get a little bit leaner in general just because I feel a lot better when I'm leaner. So like I said, I've been incorporating some cardio and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna eat a carb before my workout and then a carb after my workout. Then I've been cutting out one carb throughout the day. So I'm probably gonna take out a carb during lunch or dinner. Just kind of depends how I feel after my workout and how many carbs I need, you know? Cause I'm gonna work out in the morning so I might just have a carb for breakfast and then in my protein shake, I might make like an actual smoothie. And then lunch, I'll have no carb. But we'll, we'll see how it goes. Um, but yeah, that's kind of like what I like to do. I think it's really important to have your carbs before and after so you have energy and then your muscles have energy to rebuild. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna show you what I eat. Hope you enjoy. Okay, so I have my sourdough toast cooking in the oven. So cute, and yes, I eat sourdough toast. I don't think it's honestly that bad if you just have one and you're about to go work out, so you're gonna go burn it off anyways. Your body needs the carbs. And it's just this sourdough bread from um, Whole Foods. And then I am cutting up an avocado right here, as you can see. And I've just cut it into little cubes. I'm gonna smash it, and I'm going to squeeze a ton of lemon. Like, literally as much lemon as I can get out of this lemon. Like, you know, okay, cool. Um, so I'm gonna do that. So I also am going to cook my bacon. This is just organic, uncured turkey bacon from Whole Foods. It is the best thing ever. I've been eating this probably for like a solid three to four months straight. Nothing else? Okay, while my bacon is cooking, I'm going to put just a little bit of this vegan butter on my sourdough toast. So you guys can see that. This is me. Miyoko's Creamery. Um, it's vegan butter from Whole Foods. And I literally just use like maybe, maybe I don't even really use a little, but I kind of put on like that much. Like I like, I like good like buttered toast, you know, not like too oily, but oh shoot. They're clean, I swear. How do they clean? Um, and then I'm just going to smash up my avocado like this. And I'm going to squeeze a little bit more lemon because like I said, I literally like to squeeze the entire lemon on my avocado toast because I love the way it tastes. I also want to mention, I am not a nutritionist by the way. This is just what works for me. Again, it, oh my God, all the seeds are coming out. <laughs> Again, <laughs> everybody is different. So just gonna put that out there guys. All right, and this is what my avocado toast looks like. And I mean, usually I just taste it to see if there's enough lemon. If not, I add more lemon. But I think I put the perfect amount this time. And then I got my three pieces of turkey bacon. They look really weird, but I promise you, they taste fire. All right, and this is what my beautiful meal looks like. We got three pieces of bacon, and we got some avocado toast. Okay, I also have this big giant jug of water. Um, I drink this every single morning because I think it's really important to start your day with some water. Uh, I've been trying to drink more just because I feel better. It's better for your skin, for every single part of you. So, 
water. And this is my energy drink. I don't specifically drink Alani New. Um, sometimes I'll have Celsius, sometimes I'll have usually just Celsius in this. Whatever's in my cabinet um, for the most part. So I just really drink, grab any protein drink that I like. This one's Stardust, it's pretty good. Does anyone else see that little like happy dance when they see food? Like I just get, <laughs> I start wiggling because I'm so excited. Okay, so my skin has been through some shit, you guys. I break out every once in a while, not even every once in a while, maybe like every other week I'll get a breakout. Like some weeks my skin will be really clear, sometimes it won't be. So I started seeing this new lady and she's putting me on these like vitamins and stuff. And this is Hypoemulsy D3 vitamin D3 drops and it tastes really good so I try not to do like put the whole thing on just like a drop or so maybe two it tastes really good and then I am going to have some of my coconut charcoal this is good for your gut so I'm going to see that and I've been told a lot of acne comes from your gut sometimes that sketch so good I have a healthy gut um and then I just chill with that because if I have anything else with charcoal like I will literally die like my stomach will rip apart and it won't be fun so yeah now I'm just gonna let my food sit just for like maybe 20 minutes and then I'm gonna go work out also I just wanted to show you like how cute are these flowers I'm obsessed with tulips and mini daisies I guess the mini daisies are actually chamomile. They're not even mini daisies. But because my name is Daisy, let's just call them mini daisies. Um, but like this is just, ah, so cute. Look at my little chickens. Hi, Harley. That's Harley and then that's Mudra. If you guys have been following my channel for a while, you already know who they are. Harley's pissed that she's outside. She hates being out there, um, but she needs to go potty. So it's okay. <laughs> all right so now i'm about to work out and i'm gonna um actually film my ab video so if you guys haven't seen that yet i'm going to do my little pyramid abs routine and i did this a couple days ago and it literally killed my abs like my abs were seriously so sore and it's really hard for me to get my abs to be sore so i was like damn okay i really need to show my friends on youtube this um so if you want perfect abs just do this okay guys i will say like look at my abs like they have been coming in so much more lately and i really think it's because i've been doing more cardio and more ab exercises Alrighty, guys i just got back from the gym and i'm gonna make my protein shake but i'm gonna kind of make it oops i'm gonna kind of make it into a meal because it's already lunch time and I need the carbs. So rather than just having protein and like almond milk or something, I'm going to make it an actual like meal smoothie. All right, so first thing is ice, and then I'm going to put in some spinach. I usually just use frozen spinach, and I put in like probably a couple handfuls. And then I do a whole banana. And I'm doing a whole banana because I just worked out, so my muscles and my body need the carbs to replenish myself. So usually I do half if I didn't just work out, but since I did, I'm going to do whole. I'm going to do some almond butter. This is seriously the best smoothie you guys will ever have. You guys need to try it. It is so good, and it literally tastes like, I don't know, like chocolate like milkshake or something i don't know it's just good you should just try it i'm gonna put a little bit more because i love almond butter and then i'm going to pour in some almond milk and i don't really know how much i put in i just yeah, kinda... almond milk! <laughs> michael was that you sorry guys that was my boyfriend um anyways once i've put in a good amount of almond milk I'm going to put in some whey protein powder and I do one scoop and this is the Girl Scout Cookie Samoa Whey Bolic um, Protein Powder by GNC. It is seriously so good. It tastes exactly like the cookie. The Thin Mint one too is incredible. Like this with just almond milk alone is insane, insane. 
And then I'm going to put some L-glutamine for recovery. Just one scoop. Ah. Oh, I hate the way that powders feel. Like, that gives me the chills. Okay, now I'm going to blend all this. Okay, and then my smoothie usually looks like... Let's go in the light more. Like this green color. It kind of looks like a mint chocolate shake. That's from the spinach. It's seriously so good. You guys need to try this if you haven't yet. And it is dinner time. Yay! I'm going to show you what I'm eating. We got some chicken, rice, green beans, and little like a nut glaze on top. I love that nut glaze. Oh my god. I cannot believe you just said that. Sorry. Michael! Just YouTube or OnlyFans? <laughs> And this meal was made by my wonderful mother. She's seriously the best cook in the world. The best. Literally, every single thing that she makes is like gourmet. Um, anyways, I'm going to eat my dinner. Okay guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Um, that is just what I eat in a day. It doesn't mean that's what you should eat in a day. It's just what I found works for me and my body and my metabolism. Anyways, I love you guys so much and thank you for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!